धलंग कुतक दि कुतक त टिकट तो पक दिम्मी पक जुन्नु पक दिम्मी तक जुन्नु दिम्मी तक जुन्न पक दिम्मी तक जुन्नु तक दिन त once again murumandi jumps without holding keeping the hands on the waist धलंग कुतक दि कुतक त टिकट तो पक दिम्मी तक जुन्नु तक दिम्मी तक जुन्नु तक जुन्नु तक दिम्मी तक जुन्नु तक दिम्मी तक जुन्नु तक दिन त then up now we go on to do the penkan adavu there is a difference in this penkan adavu also please spread your legs watch this adavu very carefully you again hold your hands together in front of you and when you go on the right side the penkan adavu meaning one leg the outstretched leg the toes must point to the ceiling and the other leg will be on the floor in kalari we have we need not lift the heel in bharatanatyam also for the exercises if you don't lift the heel the stretch will be better in the inner thighs for you to open up in the adavas but you can do by lifting the heels now two students of mine will show you both the different forms of the praying can adavas dhalang kutaka de kutaka ta tikita tom tak dim mi tak jon no this is not lifting the heel how much ever you can sit you can sit lakshita and bavya the more you sit without lifting the heel the more you get the stretch in the inner thigh now go to the other side tak dim mi tak jon no tak dim mi tak jon now you can show the difference by lifting the heel and sitting on your toes but one the prankan that is the other leg outstretched with the toes pointing the ceiling dalang kutaka de kutaka ta tikita tom tak dim mi tak sit some more correct tak dim mi tak jon tak dim mi tak jon tak dim mi tak din tam now i will ask lakshita to do raising the heels and bhavya will do the same prankan adav without raising the heel as the third exercise dhalang kutaka de kutaka ta tikita tom tak dim mi tak jon 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 the next speed dalang kutaka de kutaka ta tikita tak dim mi tak jon tak dim mi tak jon tak dim mi tak jon dim mi tak jon tak dim mi tak jon tak dinata